In East Texas Park, centered around hope and community, is celebrating two decades of comforting families mourning the loss of a child. Thank you for joining us here on CBS 19 News at 10. I'm Jesus Martinez. Robert Del Garza was at the Children's Park of Tyler this afternoon speaking with family and friends and organizers as to why this park means so much to them. Loss is loss. You know, if someone loses a child, we do not grieve alone. And there is hope on the other side of grief. And that's what the Children's Park of Tyler is for, a resource that supports families suffering through various stages of loss for a child. Um, so today's just celebrating that. We're just celebrating all the families that we've, we've touched and hope to, to help and touch more lives. Saturday was a day for family fun. Putt-Putt in the park as part of the park's 20-year anniversary to highlight the park's purpose and help families, like Daisy Phillips, who experienced a miscarriage less than a year ago. Well, that it's a club that you never want to be a part of and you never want new members. This was a chance for Daisy to help herself open up about her pain and reach out to others in similar situations for comfort. Um, however, when you do find out that someone has experienced loss, it's an opportunity to really shepherd and be vulnerable and to let somebody know that, hey, if I, I've experienced this as well and it was hard for me and I'm, I'm here for you. So. There's just experiences that we have daily as we're walking through grief that other people that have not walked it don't understand. So. Board member Jessica DeVilbas says opening up and asking for help can be one of the biggest challenges after losing a child. I was a little weary, but I took a deep breath and walked through that threshold and they greeted me with open arms and, and said, whatever you feel is okay to feel here. Jessica lost her child at 34 weeks as a stillborn. There was no way I was going to survive without some kind of support. Um, and, and this group really, really helped launch me into this new new part of my life. So today has just been very heartwarming. It's been very light. It's been, it's been a very light-hearted way um, for such a incredibly intimate and uh, devastating topic. True. Reporting in Tyler, Robert De La Garza, CBS 19. And Day of Remembrance will be next month at the Children's Park of Tyler, where a roll call will honor.